Chapter 21 looks at a topic we haven't considered before, and that is the future. So that is what we in accounting call budgeting. So we have a need for budgeting because when you look at all the reports we've made, so we can see an income statement and a cash flow statement on the screen, they're actually always prepared for the year ended, uh, as in they are actually summarizing events that have already happened. And whilst this is good, because we like to analyze what did actually occur so we can learn from it, they're technically out of date as soon as they're prepared. So for 2015, for example, on balance day, um, on the 31st of December, the reporting period would end. Well, the reports wouldn't actually get prepared for 2015 until in uh, 2016. And the income statement, the cash flow statement, and the balance sheet are actually out of date the minute they're published. So, because they're already out of date, we don't say they're useless. They do have a use. We do still use them and we can interpret meaning from them and analyze and make decisions, which is what accounting is all about. But we have a need for more information and that is budgeting. It's actually the opposite of preparing reports uh, based on things that have already happened. And it's all about planning for the future by making some estimates of what we think will happen or we expect to happen in future periods. So for example, in 2015, we would start preparing the budget for 2016. So you can see here, these are all budgeted reports for the following year. And that is the exact opposite of everything we've done so far. And when we sort of go back to some theory, we can see why we should and shouldn't do this. So the qualitative characteristic of relevance says that budgeting is very relevant because it enables us to plan and make decisions about the future. For example, if we think we're going to run out of money next period, we can start to take some measures now to save money or maybe get some more. However, this is very unreliable. It totally breaches the qualitative characteristic of reliable because we are making guesses and estimates about every single number in that budget. We don't have any source documents to back it up and it is important to do budgeting, but we do need to realize that it is just a series of guesses and it totally breaches reliability. You can see this in a reasonably recent case study about Bridge Connections, which is a toll road in Queensland. Similar to CityLink here in Melbourne, drivers would drive on it and get charged a toll. And Bridge Connections was the company that operated that toll road. So they did a budget and we can see it's actually the green bar chart here. So these charts here, for example, is what they forecast what would happen. So you can see within 12 months after the toll road opening, they were budgeting for 90,000 cars every day. And obviously each car would uh, get charged a certain amount, so they'd be doing some revenue forecast based on this. But then we can see what actually happened. So what actually happened was these orange numbers here. So after five months, it had completely plateaued and it was actually uh, barely half of what they budgeted to happen. And that's a, one of the problems with budgeting is that it doesn't always turn out as you guessed or hoped. And we can see for Bridge Connections, the fallout is that they actually went into liquidation. I um, sorry, administration, and they've had to, they're still existing, but they've had to completely rewrite their forecasts. And the good thing about doing that budget is they can see, well, we're way off our goals. How can we now go about fixing it? And that's the one good thing about a budget. We have something to aim for, and if we don't achieve it, we can look at ways to fix it. In VCA accounting, it's quite simple. What do I need to budget for? You've only got a budget for three things. You've got a budget for the income statement, the cash flow statement, and the balance sheet, and that's it. It could just be a part of one, could be all of one, um, but they're the three things that you need to be able to budget for for future periods.